Hey guys, this is HBK Grant from Dark Shinobis. I'm making a video about my Bolto Prime's build today. The Bolto Prime is a really strong primary rifle. If you do not have it, you could get it from other players for about 90 to 150 platinum. Uh, one thing everybody has to remember now after the Riven Mods uh, introduction into the game, primary, melee, secondary, like to reach the maximum potential of that weapon, you will need to get uh, your hands on a Riven Mod for that concerned uh, weapon. Now moving on with the builds for the Bolter Prime, I kind of made like a hybrid build for the Corpus, Infested and Grenier at the same time and it's like a viral build and it gets the job done for even higher level missions. You could use a Prime Crayo Rounds which you can get from the Burketeer or Players and the Serration and the Infected Clip from regular missions whereas the Split Chamber you can get from Voltrans from the Derelict. Uh, it's easy to get there. The Malignant Force from the Vore in the Void missions, like level 30, 40 Void missions. Uh, Piercing Caliber is like an event mod, but you can still get it from other players. Uh, uh, Rifle Aptitude, another common drop, and Heavy Caliber from the Vault Runs in the Derelict. So with this, you will have like about 1400-ish Viral, like about like 800-ish uh, Puncture, and like about 40, close to 40% status. So that's what you're basically looking for. Now to test your builds, you can come to the Strata Relay and go to Fast Travel and then from Fast Travel you're going to go to Cephalon Cimarus. Once you're at the Cephalon Cimarus area, you're going to go into the right side from the Cephalon and you're going to see there's like a blue orb and from there if you can find the similar room key that's good, if not just go to the miscellaneous and from that the second line and the last one the similar room access key, you need 50,000 standings to get this. Once you have that, you can come over here and access this right here. So the first enemy that we're going to try to kill is the infested healer. So um, I, um, I kind of like made my build. So like if you could survive the sorties and the high level uh, bounties in the Plains of Eidolon. So this is the first uh, infested. So if you kill it, like you could see how fast I killed it right there. And the second one, we're going to try the arid uh, gunners. Now, a lot of people might say like, hey, viral's not for the gunners, but or the uh, grenieres, but it's just like I just said, like it's like a hybrid build in my opinion you could just use this build so like you don't have to go through multiple configurations so as you could see the gunner is actually harder to kill but like all the other grenadiers did die pretty fast oh uh, the third one that we're gonna do is the uh, co corpus ones so the techs are usually like one of the strongest ones in the corpus so i'm gonna select a corpus tech and you should be able to uh, like smoothly go through all the sortie missions, even the last sortie mission, 80 to 100, uh, with this build. So that's the corpus, just like that. So the, now with the build that I use, uh, the game changer for everybody's uh, Boltor or any other weapon will be basically the Riven mod. Now my Riven mod basically has a status duration, plus damage, plus multi-shot, so it creates a really a different kind of an experience with the Boltor, because my damage is almost like doubled in a way. So whatever I did in the previous build, I'm actually doing double just because of that Riven mod. So I'm gonna pick like go like backwards now and I'm gonna pick up the Corpus Tech and as you see it will literally take like almost 10 bullets and I killed the uh, Corpus Tech. Now I'm gonna go for the Arid Gunner. Now again the Gunners don't go for the uh, Viral but still like even with this build if you see just like take a quick peek at it like it, it just literally chewing through the Gunners health compared to the previous build. The last one I'm going to pick is basically the infested, uh, the ancient healer, obviously. And then as you can see over here, what it's going to do to the uh, healer, it is insane. Basically, it's literally going to chew off the health in like, uh, like 14, 16 bullets. Now, I'm just going to put all three enemies basically here. So the uh, infested, the grenier and the corpus. So, and we'll see like how we fare and I'll reload each time I kill an enemy. So what we'll do is like for, first of all, we're try gonna do the infested. So if I see uh, like 12 bullets, I'm gonna reload right now to see like how many bullets it takes to kill these. So about like 13 bullets or so. And I'm gonna reload again. For the Grenier, it takes like almost like a mag and it comes back to doing it so like just for the grenier part like it is a little bit ineffective but uh, a little bit lower levels like you should be able to chew through all the enemies that are there so i hope you guys like this video and 
If you have any questions, leave it in the section below. Please like and subscribe. This is HBK Grant signing out. Have a good one, guys. Take care.